Hello students, welcome to our channel Learning Notebook. In today's video, I am giving you lot of ideas on how to create Maths Art Integrated Project on Uttar Pradesh. First idea for your Maths Art Integrated Project is Population of Uttar Pradesh. You can depict population of Uttar Pradesh through beautiful bar graphs or line graph as shown here. Double bar graphs can be used to show male and female ratio of population of Uttar Pradesh. Then you can take help of a line chart to show Sex ratio of population of Uttar Pradesh as shown here. Students, if you want information about history, geography, people, culture, festivals, food, dances, dresses and famous places of Uttar Pradesh, then do watch our separate video. The link to this comprehensive video is here on the top and in the description box. Now, the next idea for your Maths Art Integrated Project is Population of Uttar Pradesh by Religion If you are enjoying watching videos on our channel, then do like, share and comment on our videos. Also, do not forget to subscribe to our channel Learning Notebook. Students, pie chart is another beautiful way to represent the given data. So you may use a pie chart to show population of Uttar Pradesh by religion. Next one is including population of Uttar Pradesh by rural and urban division. See here. How we have used two pie charts to compare rural and urban population of Uttar Pradesh for two years. Next idea is depicting literacy rate of Uttar Pradesh.
Here we have used triple bar graph to show overall literacy rate, male literacy rate and female literacy rate of Uttar Pradesh. Now next idea for your maths art integrated project is depicting languages of Uttar Pradesh. Again, you can take help of a pie chart to show different languages of Uttar Pradesh as shown here. Now, let's see how you can take ideas from climate of Uttar Pradesh for your maths art integrated project. Students, here we are going to depict climate of Lucknow, which is the capital of Uttar Pradesh. You can take help of a line graph to show month-wise average, high and low temperature of Lucknow as shown here. You can also depict month-wise average rainfall in Lucknow. Again using line graph. Then you can represent month-wise average humidity in Lucknow as shown here. Now the last and one of the important topic for your maths art integrated project is agriculture of Uttar Pradesh. Students, you can take help of bar graph to show area, yield or production of major crops in Uttar Pradesh. So now, I hope you have got lot of ideas on how to create maths art integrated project on Uttar Pradesh. Thanks for watching. See you in the next video.